At Bulwa, we're all affected, but my management team and I are fully committed to supporting our employees through this process. As well as honouring all of our obligations to our employees and providing transition support, we will redouble our focus on safe and reliable operations and keep everyone fully informed as we go through this process. We have a strong track record of safety here at Bulwer Island and I'm committed that we will continue to operate with high standards of safety until we complete the transition to a jet fuel terminal. For BP in Australia, this allows us to access reliable and competitive sources of product supply and enables us to focus our resources and capital in growing the other parts of our business. We remain fully committed to all of our customers here in Queensland and nationally and we'll be looking, for, looking actively for opportunities to grow our commercial and retail business. So as I said to our employees this morning, our immediate focus remains on safe and reliable operations and we will be operating essentially as normal for approximately the next 12 months. Um, we will need approximately 12 months for uh, ourselves and Caltex to put in place the infrastructure we need for the new supply arrangements. Uh, the majority of our staff will still be required through to the first quarter of 2015, as I said this morning, and we will transition over the first half of 2015 from a refinery operations to a jet fuel terminal. As I mentioned, one of the key drivers is the large modern refineries in Asia. So we will be sourcing jet fuel from that supply chain and importing it through what is currently our crude import facility, um, utilising our tanks and infrastructure here and supplying it through to Brisbane Airport. I think the overall reaction was uh, fairly subdued. Um, I have regular communications with the workforce. Um, we communicate our performance to them, including regular meetings with our employee representatives. Everyone's uh, well aware that um, the business has been making a loss for some time, so I don't think this announcement has come as a surprise. We will meet all of our obligations and we believe we've got uh, the necessary resources to support our employees, provide them with the right transitional support. 